We're going to look up, lo load up the, um, I got to set up all my scenes and everything again too. Tomorrow, that's probably what I'm going to work on since I hopefully don't need to drive tomorrow. I haven't drove, driven in like a, a month, which is great. Haven't needed to is uh, try to get my stream reset up for single PC streaming and just use my my laptop for chat and bots and stuff. So Jack O Lantern, let's see what a Jack O Lantern looks like. Gym time later, folks. All right, Ems, let's have a good one. I'll have I will do my best to have a good stream, sir. And happy Halloween to you. This should be its own video on YouTube. <laughs> Zooming into my face. Let's try playing. Autonauts, it's a game where you program robot slaves to do your job and make more robot slaves. Fortunately, you need to feed some humans to progress in research, and you cannot vent them. You hope that's not a problem? That sounds awesome. So, that's two games I think I need to check out. What was the other one? Spaz, Space Pirates and Zombies? So, Space Pirates and Zombies. And Zombies. And... Autonauts. I have not heard of Autonauts, but having robots, you know, duplicate themselves and kill humans sounds like my type of game. I'll, I'll tell you. Sounds like that's right up my alley. Have I played Arsenal Plus? I have Jellyfisher Dumb uh, with some ships made for it. But uh, I don't like, I'm not a huge fan of game, the, of the mods that go too crazy with adding stuff like crazy events and insane weapons and stuff. They're fun every once in a while, but I don't like to spend a lot of time in them, so. Alright, let's see. Where is this? <laughs> there it is. Pumpkin Type A. A terrifying Halloween special. Be wary of when it turns out it's lights. Many a fright might be had. <laughs> Alright, I like that picture. Whoa, look at him. That's a big old pumpkin. <laughs> This is from Zack Dog, by the way. Zack Dog created the, the Jack O' Lantern. It's got a Crystal Burst Mark II, the rarest weapon in the game. You know, it'd be neat for Spooky Day, the new Carry On demo that got released released on Steam lately. Uh, I I don't know what that is. I don't know. It's like 3D version of Factorio. That sounds amazing. Because one of the, my one of the games I've enjoyed the most that I've played the last six months or so was Satisfactory. I really like Satisfactory. I'm looking forward to that one because when that gets finished. Best ship ever and no human crew. <laughs> Got a firebomb, crystal burst mark two, and a basic laser with fire suppression. Oh, it's got all the fire stuff going on because it's a jack-o'-lantern. Interesting. Hey, there's Jack Dog. What's up, sir? Hey, what's up, Cyclogger? How are you doing? Carry on, carry on is a reverse horror game where you play a red bloody blob monster trying to grow and survive on human meat. Wow. Uh, Crystal Burst Mark II is a weapon that can only be found in the crystal sector. And it has high rarity. So basically you have to buy it in the crystal sector or get a random RNG free weapon in the crystal sector and get really lucky. If you think it's rare to get to the Crystal Sector, getting this weapon is even more rare. But from my experience, trying to use this weapon kind of sucks because it's so slow. It's high damage. Three damage that pierces one shield. There's a 17 second charge time. So. But we'll use it for those who haven't seen it before. Alright, we'll see you later, later David, David Rosenberg. Have a good one. Oh, you mean like anti-bio beam in stores? Yeah, so rare. Oh god, Pulsar's gonna kill me. I might just restart immediately. Alright, an immediate human event, huh? Well, we do have cloaking. I wonder what it cloaked. <laughs> Look, it's got an orange shield. <laughs> I love it. I love the orange shield. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. It's kind of dark with the cloaking. Nice. Oh, it's like a triple thing. Okay. This is basically a burst laser crystal weapon. So, pretty freaking OP. But it's kind of slow, so. That's it's, that's the downside. It's slow. Damn it. Uh. 
Frickin' Pulsar, man. Frickin' Pulsar. Alright, we should be fine, though. Um, let's use... Let's actually use Firebomb and Basic Laser here. Might actually be quicker. If it gets his shields, it did okay. Cloak. Damn. I don't know if I was too late or that was just BS right there. Probably just BS. Mm. Should have got here earlier. No, stop hitting my weapons. That's okay. I'm restarting. F you game. I don't. I'm not dealing with this shit. This is Halloween. I'm not dealing with your crap. FTL. Just cheat and leave until we get a better start. Do I have room for another emote? No, we Titans. I don't have enough. I don't have a room for another emote slot yet. I think I have to be partner before I get another one, or I don't know. I don't actually know if I have the max for an affiliate or not. I probably don't. But uh, since we're kind of on the cusp of partnerhood, um, I'm thinking we'll probably get partner before we get any more emote slots. That pumpkin just stared into your soul. <laughs> Too bad there are no closed, unaccessible rooms with infinite fires. Oh, yeah. Fire suppression is actually great here. <laughs> That's right. I don't have to put out the fires. I have fire... Wow. Uh, this spread before fire spread. Fire suppression, you suck, by the way. Uh, an augment made to put out fires could not put out a fire before it spread. Learn to vent. Uh, fire venting thing. Fire suppression. A spooky weapon. Shame if something happened to them. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Okay. Well, apparently we're just going to get all the fires. You're thinking something like anti-bio beam within stores now over it. Oh. <laughs> no, I don't want... I don't want a... Um, an emote that goes even harder on the anti-bio beam thing. Somebody did say an emote the other day that I can't that I thought was a really good idea, but I don't remember what it was. Hey, Cyclogger, thank you for the bits. Appreciate that. You as well have a happy Halloween. I should do something for Halloween, but I'll probably do nothing. Because that's what I do. Because I'm a bum. Alright, so we want to try to get his missile offline. Probably his missile will get my weapon offline, although I can cloak it. It's basically a channel like meme now. It is. It. It like Doesn't mean I have to like it. I have to turn stream audio off right now, but yeehaw, Rand, I'll still be All right, watching. Zach, Thank you for the 100 bits, my friend. Thank you for the ship, too. 80% dodge? It's basically zero. Go. Okay, so if I do this, as long as we get this off, uh, time he should, he should pull him that was loud was it maybe I need to turn the um, notification sounds down and then keel with the twitch prime sub so much welcome to the randoms my friend appreciate that 100% dodge or nothing okay sounds like I might need to turn my alerts down Uh, where's volume? Alert delay. Do I have to change the volume of every single one? Sound volume's at 44%. Are they loud? Okay. I'll go down by like half. So there's that. That's the follow softer. Subscription. Go down by half. Save that one. I have a lot of um, things here, so I'm going to have to do them all here. 50% on these. Donation one. Okay. Uh, bits. Down to 40%. And what else? Bits. Merch raids. Okay, that's, that's most of them. Okay. Okay, hopefully that'll be better. Hold! 
Oh, there's Ion Blast Mark II. Happy Halloween to me. All right. Well, let's get level two piloting in the nebula for hopefully free blue stuff. Is that a pamkin? <laughs> it is a pamkin. Antipode fabricator. I love your name, by the way. It's a pumpkin. It's a big old jack-o'-lantern. All right, you have double heavy lasers, but I got cloaking. So how's that? How you like dim apples? How you like dim pumpkins? You love my pumpkin? <laughs> well, you can thank Zack Dog. It was created by the wonderful Zack Dog in chat. I carved it myself. I didn't really carve it. I could. I couldn't carve it. Could I do this? I could probably carve that. I haven't carved a pumpkin since I was a kid. I remember it being very hard and very smelly. I always hated the smell. I was never a big fan of the smell of pumpkins. Do I like Stellaris? Have you seen the new Lithiodes DLC? Uh, I thought Stellaris was fine. I didn't love Stellaris. Again, it's one of those games, those space games that are like super complicated. And like, pretty um, repetitive, so. I mean, it was cool for what it was, but I didn't love it enough to want to spend tons and tons of stream hours to learn it. I do have a lot of stuff to sell here. Um, all right, let's go to the store, see what you got. Best part of carving pumpkins is roasting the seeds after. Yeah, I don't, I don't, oh god, wow, flack, okay. I don't, I don't like pumpkin flavored stuff, so. Man, do I get rid of the fire meme stuff just to get an actual build going? I kind of want to. <laughs> um, as much as I love all this fire stuff, I have to get flack. Like, it's, I am, uh, contractually obligated to get a flak online. So that is flak plus crystal burst mark two. Carving pumpkins is really hard. I'm not sure if you have the right tools. It's not the worst. Just gotta have the right tools. Right tool for the job. The new Stellaris DLC added a new species type. Rock people eat rocks instead of food. And one type of empire of rock people can devour entire worlds. That's cool. That's cool. That's right, Stellaris has a pretty steep learning curve. Yeah. And Antipode Fabricator. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it, my friend. Welcome to the stream. Can't stay long today, but you'll leave a follow because you seem really cool. I, I, I try. You know, it's easy to stay cool when you have no hair. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Um, this jack-o'-lantern feels weird because I can't tell where the front of the ship is. I feel like the front of the ship is staring into my soul. I like how the uh, rooms are around the uh, like eyes, nose, and mouth. So it's like it's like the jack-o'-lantern is wearing a helmet. Like I could imagine this being a Minecraft you know, zombie with a pumpkin head wearing a gold helmet on it or something. Okay. Do, 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 do. So if I wanted to get a uh, flak online, I would need 85 scrap plus power. Okay. So I need power and then 85 scrap. You'll just leave this here. What is this? Now in stores, bio, anti, bio beam. <laughs> Is that your is that your attempt at creating an emote now in store? I don't know what that three card thing is. Is that like a is that like a common um, icon for things that are available in stores? Oh God, you sir, you know how to bribe. Yeah, I'll take a free missile. I'll take a free weapon. That's like a thirty something scrap free deal right there. This just seems for like pretty cool psychological horror game. And I just played um let's played Layers of Fear 2 and I'm still kinda jumpy from that. <laughs> I don't think I want to do any more psychological horror games for a while. Oh, you just actually found that online? You just found that? <laughs> now available in store, anti-bio beam. <laughs> 
Was there frosting between the layers? The layers of what? The layers of what? Of fear. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, there was no frosting. There was um, horrible, scary jump scares. That's what there was between the layers of fear. Jump scares. That's what I found. Apparently, my brother is doing another karaoke night this weekend. Maybe that's what I'll do for Halloween is go... Ugh, God, it's Saturday, and I have early morning service on Sunday. I don't think that's going to work. Did they make you frosting your pants with... <laughs> no, but uh, somebody did say I had to change my, my pants a couple times because of being scared. So I didn't, but people made that joke, yes. Aid the ship. You have a flak plus a heavy laser one. If I did not have cloaking, this would be scary. I'm liking the cloaking people are giving me on these beginning ships. I like it a lot. Uh oh. Damn. Um, for anybody who watches the um, RPG stream I normally do on Friday with Shogi, we are not doing it tomorrow because apparently there are big fires in California again and he has no power because of it. So send good vibes to Shogi. Shogi has no power. Yikes. Let me, uh, let me respond to him real quick. Do I get... Ooh, nice. Zoltan. Into my shields, bro. Beautiful. Uh, so Shogi says, no power to the fires. Oh, man. He had his... Oh, God. He had his dog put down, too. Yikes, man. Let me, let me send him some love real fast. Frickin' one-two punch right there. So send send some love to Shogi. Because, uh... He's... We're, apparently, all of us are not the only ones having lonely and frustrating times right now. It's that time of year. Sending you love, man. Damn it. If I could... If I could type... Okay, why does send not autocorrect to other stupid crap? Uh, same thing with the beam and the little squares. You don't need to open it. Okay. What do you mean again? Kelly has been on fire for the last six years straight? Yeah. But I have a lot of family who's been affected by it because I grew up in California. Simi Valley, a bunch of fires happened there, and that's where I think uh, Shogi lives and a lot of my family lives. So they're. It's crazy how, how many. I don't understand how. Why they get so much fire stuff there. Is that a pumpkin? It is a pumpkin. A delicious. Delicious? A pumpkin, yes. Okay, I'm gonna need one thing here. Okay. Like that. And we fight this guy. Get the missile offline. Beautiful. Ah, uh, man, you are losing that fight, bro. At least he didn't get the missile back online. Hold it. This guy has dodged, um, I think, 50% of shots exactly so far. Okay, he's drone controls offline. Good. Could you please stop dodging 50% of my shots? pg and &E was blamed for the campfire last year in California, so now they keep shutting off power whenever conditions are hazardous. Just FYI. Is pg and &E like a... Is that a... 
power company? I, I don't know what PG&E is. I gotta go heal my bro. Pacific Gas and Electric. Oh, okay. They were blamed for the campfire last year. Interesting. Uh, nope, not a good deal. We got that offline. That's good. Maybe that's why he doesn't have power. Maybe he has that power company and it's because of that that they shut down. Yikes. Man, I swear the natural disasters lately, lately have been crazy. Here in Dallas, we had probably the worst tornado of the last, well, since I've been here, I think, so like 10 years or something. And then California's getting fires again. Just, it is a time of year for stuff to hit the fan, I guess. It sucks. Help my crews become all, help, my crews come all powerful. Two Zoltans, an NG, three Mantis, and two Rockmen. Why are you saying help? You mean, yay, celebration. Crystal Burst can pierce shields. All crystal weapons pierce one shield. That's a feature. That is a feature of crystal weapons. And this is super OP one because there's three shots. I really don't even think this one's that good because it's three shots for three damage. Yeah, it pierces one shield, but once you get past this, like, sector two, that's not super useful. Planned outages can affect up to 2.7 million people. There's an article for it. Wow. Holy explosive replicator. Okay, we've got some good stuff to sell. I have a Hermes and explosive replicator, and I still don't want to use missiles because Hermes is three damage for three power. So do you have other good weapons? No. You do have hacking. Um, Let's see here. It's too much. You are too OP, and I can't stop from poning everything, eh? I could get hacking or I could get flak online with this crystal burst. It's not really that good a combo. You finally found some time to join the stream. You've been having a hard time lately. You're ready for spooky FTL run. Nice, I'm Saren. There's been a lot of people with having a hard time lately, so come chill out. Come chillax, my friend. I mean, hacking plus cloaking is, is the OPness, so we're going to do it. We're going to go ahead and do that. We'll get power. Now we'll save up to try to get the weapon. Maybe we'll get something we can trade out this crystal burst for. Even though it's supposed to be amazing, it's just it's just too slow, man. It's just too slow. Investigate. Intruders on board. And, uh, oh, God, hacking my weapons. Okay. Damn it. Okay, we're gonna do. Freaking hell, it's a missile. If it was anything but a missile, this would be fine. But I can't move this guy off and dodge here. Freaking annoying. Game, you are annoying. Alright, I'm gonna hack your weapons. You know what? You're gonna hack my weapons? I'll hack your weapons, you piece of crap. Maybe you should have hacked his hacking, possibly. Okay. All right, hack the missile. We're 2v3ing now, so we should be able to win this or 3v2ing. Beautiful. No more missiles for you, dirtbag. Dirtbanger. I should get this online. Problem is you've been giving an option to get another rock. Oh, so so the problem is is you're so OP and you can't keep up with all your OPness. <laughs> I know that problem. I have that myself. All right, no more hacking for you. And you're trying to run. Are you freaking kidding me? Damn it, he's gonna get out because of health. Slow this weapon is maybe. Oof, just in time. Come on, come on. No, I hate this game. All right, he shouldn't get to go. He didn't get the extra 
chump thing because he wasn't warning them, but still, that's bullshit. That's why I don't like weapons like this. People are like, oh, that weapon's awesome. Pierce a shield, three power, does three damage. Yeah, it's a freaking year and a half to charge. So they, run, if anybody runs away, you're screwed. Hate that crap. Hate that crap so much. Uh, maybe I should swap the flak. Just like hack and flak here. Oh my god. Pulsar, come on. Alright, we're just doing, doing, gonna do this then. Um, I'm gonna probably hack his weapons. Crap. Let's time that. Lovely, lovely. Frickin' beam drone you have there. I didn't even notice the beam drone. I can hack the weapons. Oh, come on. There were two shots that hit there, but they just happened to fucking dodge those two shots. Yeah. Yeah, it's freaking fair, you dumbass game. Come on, game. Don't make me so mad on Halloween. Give me some give me some luck here. I guess my luck is that my weapons haven't gone offline. Hope that. Hack that. Yes. F you FTL. Give me a deal. Their weapons and drones like never went offline except when I shot them. Come on, game. Give me a break here. Petition to remove standard dodge mechanics from pulsars. Yes. Sure. Seconded. I agree. Alright. Um how many jumps do I have? Four? One, two, three. No, one, two, three, four. I'd like to have my shields and weapons before we leave. Pulsars are the worst event to write in. To write in. Uh, I don't know what you mean by that, but yes, I they're the worst. Um, I think they're probably the worst hazard. Okay, well, nice weapons you have there, sir. All right, we can cloak it. It's fine. Um, can I can I not get boarded like every other jump? Boarding and four weapon shots. All right, game. Where are my OP viewerships? That's what I want to know. Literally, he's dodging over 66% of shots to be able to not take damage here. All right, killed that human. Get wrecked, you piece of crap. You just got rock plating on Mantis B. What sector? This is sector two, by the way. Freaking sector two. Value point and shields, you know, as as you would expect from every ship in sector two. I have this much room to hit, and look where my shots go. Two of them are outside. This is dumb. <laughs> this is fucking stupid. What's up, Klaus Dieter? Happy Halloween. I'm salty. How about you? Apparently, for not getting my weapons upgraded, I'm getting punished. Finally. Freaking finally. When they shoot me with a flak, it never ends up on the outside edges with every goddamn shot. You gotta go. All right, Vibsy. Have a good night, my friend. We'll see you later. This guy had to blow... Some guy be a jerk and blow up a tool you deployed. Because didn't shoot directly. He didn't get jumped by cops. That sounds like stuff I wouldn't want to have to deal with in EVE Online, so I don't know if I want to, want to get into that. First words I hear, this is dumb, this is effing stupid. Yes, that is that's par for the course for FTL. How is it, Vorion? It is great. I, uh, I haven't played it since last week when I beat it uh, because we I played a uh, scary game on Monday. Yesterday I didn't stream because I had... Um, uh, 
at a rehearsal I had to had to run basically and uh, Tuesday we played more FTL so Should've been doing other stuff 80% dodge might as well be effing zero dodge cool I'm getting stupidly bad RNG big surprise dodge 66% of my shots and I can't dodge at 80% dodge I can't dodge a missile cool F your effing, effing piece of F missiles. You effing effer. It's quite the ship to log into. Yeah. Quite the ship to play as you get shitty RNG the entire time, too. If I could have gotten, like, any weapon to go with this flak, any laser weapon, I would be in such a better position. But Crystal B is slow and expensive. Thank God. There, get rid of that shit. I imagine having 95% dodge, a missile shot still hits and causes a double fire in a breach. Imagine that. I've probably had that happen before. Sounds like my FTL RMG. You need a potato ship that absorbs salt. Okay. I need a ship that absorbs salt. Okay. <laughs> the anti-salt ship. There's, there's another ship for somebody to design. The anti-salt ship. Um... No, I'm not offering 40 scrap for that guy. I forget what the blue option is for that Zoltan who says our stuff is appalling. I forget what the blue option is for that. But I'm not paying 40 scrap for Zoltan, that's for sure. I need a freaking weapon upgrade is what I need. All right, intruders on board. And a missile, oh my god. I just got fucking four, four Mantis boarding event. This is so ridiculous. This is Sector Effing 2, right? I'm pretty sure this is freaking Sector 2 right now. Jesus Christ, man. What the fuck is this shit? I shouldn't be this salty for freaking Halloween stream, man. This is insane. What the hell is actually happening? Okay, I have to do this and this to, like, survive right now. Uh, where do I go with you? I guess I'll keep NG there and you there. This is frickin' Sector 2, man. Christ. Alright, 65 is probably zero. No, okay, we actually did dodge there. I don't know how we win this. Uh, I don't know how I don't lose crew here, honestly. With four goddamn mantis on my ship. I actually don't know how I uh, don't die. Got to go here and hope my O2 recovers fast enough in this room. Can I, can I please have some O2? Jesus Christ, game. At least we got his stuff offline there. Okay. Um, I need to force him. No! <laughs> I, just, I just killed my slug. Did I? Okay, alright, he's not dead yet. Oh my god, man. This is fucking stupid. This is so frustrating right now. Four fucking borders, man. Four mantis borders. Sector two. I have to run. Fuck FTL. That's what I have to say right now. Fuck FTL. This is so stupid.
God damn this fucking game. Excuse my language. I'm sorry. This is bullshit. This is a bullshit couple of jumps right here. This is so stupid. Stupidly shit RNG I'm having right now. I cannot believe how bad this is. No matter how much I play FTL, when I get shit RNG like this, I just can't help but be so goddamn salty about it. If you do your trick or treat but instead of candy, you get salt shakers. That's right. Happy Halloween where the candy is sweet and Rand is salty. That's right. Really? He's going to send more? Because oh, he has... He had three free mantis and he has a fucking clone bay. Are you... I'm kidding me with this game right now. Are you kidding me with this shit? I, I honestly can't believe what I've had, what is happening right now. Couldn't even repair my shields before I get boarded another fucking time. This is so dumb, man. This is so goddamn stupid. God damn it, I hate you, FTL. I hate you so much. Please effing die. Yeah, come on in and get vented, you piece of shit. Okay, he's dead. About to lose my... Do I lose my Zoltan in here? Okay, I think I don't. But I might if this Mantis gets in here. Oh my god, it seems like FTL hates me too. That's sure what it feels like, that's for sure. God damn it, I cannot believe this. This 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 event right here. Goddamn missile. Three free mantis borders. Oh my god, that was brutal. Someone should make a ship where you have four man teleporting with four mantis reskin to look like ghosts. Okay. Cool. I just raged so hard at that event because we went from some shitty event to s this shitty event, and I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm in sector two right now. That was a sector two five man mantis boarding event, I think, right there, or four four mantis plus an NG boarding, just absolutely insane. Sector fucking two. That is ridiculous. That is absolutely insane. So I might have just lost the run right there. <laughs> God damn it, man. Oh, this game makes me rage so hard. This game makes me rage so goddamn hard. So stupid. How about you give me something good for that shit game? Thank you. Let me sell some missiles so I can get a weapon upgrade here. Oh my god, okay. Give me give me free stuff. Stay away from the freaking Zoltan sector. Weren't you going to not be Zoltan anymore? I was going to try. And for a while I was doing okay, but FTL is... When FTL does this kind of crap to me, it's so hard. It's so hard. Yeah, that was Sector 2. That was Sector 2 I just got that crap. Are they hacking my engines? Whatever, that's fine. Yep, I was trying for a while to be less salty. And I, I was success I succeeded for about a day. How what what How did the mini beam hit me? My shields are online right now. You stupid piece of crap. <laughs> How did that hit me? Literally my shields were online as that mini beam hit me. Like the timing for that to actually hit me. I just don't I don't understand. You gotta go have a less salty stream. All right, we'll see you later, programmatic. You just flipped your ship this rate, so you can you can understand the salt. Yeah, it's just this this stupid crap is what happens every time I play. Get that, get that out of here. One time I lost the game because a solar flare took out your engines. Yeah, I've had, I've had solar flares end me many times. 
I think this guy's got an NG and a repair drone, by the way. For how quickly he just repaired that whole stuff. Oh, man. All right, all right. Everything's chill. It's fine. We just are almost dead and have nothing to sell to go to a store, so I can't get a good weapon. If I, You know what? If I can get something to replace this crystal first, too, would I sell it? Maybe. Okay. No, all right. So we just repair here. It's fine. It's fine. Just douchebag FTL being a douchebag FTL. Stop it, please. Hacking Zoltan Shield Missile Sector 3. Okay, let's do this. Uh, you don't have an offensive drone, so I can do this. Of course. Why wouldn't you hack my hacking? Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you just know? It's immediately what I'm going to do. And he is immune to this first Pulsar thing because... Because he gets his ult and shield thing, which is the counter to this. And of course, the first Pulsar... Guess what it hits, guys? Guess what it hit? Weapons and shields. Weapons and shields. I cannot believe this RNG right now. This is actually insane. Pulsar hits... Oh, oh, and I can't even use my hack, even though... It, oh, okay. I guess it destroyed my drone. Oh, God. I'm so salty right now. This is so dumb. Man. And he hits my weapons. Uh, fucking hate you, game. I fucking hate you. Seventy-five percent dodge. Get hit. Of course, of course. Uh, no, I don't take your, your shitty surrender, you piece of crap. <laughs> I am so pissed off, man. Ugh, is this supposed to be a fun holiday day of streaming? And I'm just so frustrated at FTL. It's normal shit doing all this stupid bullshit to me here over and over oh my god this is so dumb it's such a stupid series of jumps that I'm getting in FDL man god damn it I just took all the damage I just repaired in that one event well, that one jump my shields come back up. I don't even have weapon training yet. I don't know how I don't have weapon training yet. I'm not... I'm definitely not gambling right now because I am losing every single gamble. Alright, a guy with no shields. But he is running. I can hack him. If my first volley doesn't hit, I will hack him. What's insane is this ship is, like, really strong. Like, starting with cloaking and a three power weapon, that's pretty darn good. It's really strong, but somehow I am getting so screwed by RG. That I'm getting completely wrecked. Zero dodges every single time. Every single volley, I'm getting nothing. Like any bad RNG that can't happen, I, I it's just never ending. Come on, game. Give me give me a little bit of help here. I need a little less screwing. My a-hole can't take it anymore. You're getting fed in getting fed in the F in the A by the F and the T in the L. Yes. 
hack the pilots that can't dodge when I shoot them. No, I'm just gonna hack their weapons. Good for us. Okay, there we go. Take no damage, beautiful. Oh, okay, alright. Alright, maybe we can maybe turn a corner and get some free stuff and recover this run that has just been stupidly bad RNG. Love the ship, by the way. Love the ship, Zack Dog. Could I could I stop getting wrecked so hard? We can get a store over here with something to replace this crystal bomb, crystal thing with. Oh, that's a, okay, that's not bad. They're in my engines. Oh my god, did they get this? Okay, I was gonna say, if they got that offline before I could even vent it, I'm just, it's like done. I'm just done. This is like four or five humans, I think, on my ship right now. They're they're busting through these doors instantly. <laughs> what? All right, what do we got? Okay, we vented the humans. Get out of here, humans. Nobody likes you. You're gonna lurk and enjoy some salty background noise. All right, Bodre, enjoy your lurking. Okay, all right. I'm hoping I'm hoping we're over the salty hurdle here. I am hoping. I'm hoping for the good stuff to start happening. When does the fun part of the stream start? That's what I want to know. Where are my stores, by the way? My only chance of store where I don't dive is one, two, three, four. So there's only here that I can get a store. Without diving, so let's check. I might need to dive for a store right now. That is a lot of weapon power for Sector 3. Five weapon power and hacking, man. Alright, well, I just, I guess I gotta do this. Okay, that's good. Let's dodge that. At least he doesn't have cloaking. I can be happy about that. I'm right, gonna just go all in on his weapons. Um, actually, if I. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do that. This will do three damage to his weapons. Value point and shields, of course, but it's Sector 3, to be expected. To be expected that. You'll have one shield, two shields, or one in a value point. Or two shields at a value point, I guess, is the other thing you could have. The other insane op -ness. All right, we hit that. That's good. There. No more doges for you, sir. Oh, we got the shot off. Nice. Get wrecked. All right. Double reward. I need a lot of those right now. I need a lot of those. There's the store. So if I go up here, I'm diving. Is it worth a dive to go to a store right now? Oh, man. Sector 3 dive is scary. I really don't like this crystal B, this crystal burst. It's so, so slow. If I were to dive, I have to double dive unless I go. I can go one, two, three, and then single dive. Okay. If I repair and got some really good offensive upgrade, it would be worth. If I didn't get an offensive upgrade, I would need to get a good defensive upgrade. So we're gonna do it. We're gonna dive. Dive to save this run. Automated reloader, no good weapons, damn. All right. Um.
could get the weapon online. God, these weapons are so anti-synergy right now. Alright, I'm gonna get defense. I'm trying to decide if I keep the Ion Stunner. I feel like I probably do. Alright, alright. Let's get some good RNG. Let's have some good stuff happen. Ho, 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 ho. Okay. Alright. Okay. Now if I get weapon power, I can have Flak plus Vulcan. That's the good stuff. I couldn't get a Vulcan last run to get a second Vulcan. Now I have a Vulcan just for free. Okay. Alright. Game on, boys. Game on. Now we're talking. I mean, 80% dodge. Might as well be zero, right, guys? Might as well be zero. Unbelievable. <laughs> it happens so frequently. I just... It blows my mind how frequently I have over 70% dodge and get hit by a missile. Just, just effing unbelievable. Good weapon, wrong run. Hey, I'll take it right now. I will take anything to save this run. Okay, all right. Let's go get healed for this dive. I think we need some happy topics up in here right now. Have you all been following Team Trees? I haven't, but I did. I finally did watch a YouTube video that mentioned it yesterday, so that does look pretty cool, what they're doing with that. Trying to plant, was it 20 million trees or something? It's pretty awesome. Another Vulcan? Yeah, we got a Vulcan. We just got it for free. Do I get flak online? I can't yet. Do I get cloaking two or hacking two here? I'm about to dive, so what if we just go here? Let's just go for defense. Vulcan is gonna carry us for a bit. Hopefully, that's the plan. How is Team Trees doing? What are they trying to do? Was it 20 million to plant 20 trees or something like that? Because every dollar is a tree. Of course, we get some humans on our ship. Okay. Do I cloak this or do I wait to the ASP? I think we have to wait for the ASP. Please just don't hit my cloaking. The engine is pretty bad though. Okay. But I can't deal with borders either. Oh god. Alright, well we force them into here. Okay, I don't know if this will last long enough, but let's hope by cloaking now do the missile land the ASP. Nice. Beautiful. That was optimal right there. Do I hack his weapons right now? No, we just need to get out of here. Uh, oh God. Okay, alright, alright. Alright, get the humans out of here. Oh, oh, we've got through. Okay. All right, I got his Vulcan offline. All right, this is going to hit. We'll jump. This is going to hit, so we'll jump it. Okay. 20 million trees is nothing. This annoys me so much that it's everywhere on the internet. Why is it nothing? I mean, the stream that I saw yesterday was on uh, Because Science. He's talking about it. He's like, yeah, it's a very small amount compared to how much is in the world, but it's something, and it's something that people are actually coming together and donating for, so I don't I don't know why, I don't know why we annoy you. What's bad about planting trees? <laughs> like, who as a human thinks that planting a bunch of trees would be bad? Uh, 
You never liked Mr. Beast, Beast, mostly because having a heart like myself, it's hard for me to summon the generosity others get from him. He's not a bad guy. You just can't watch others be helped while I sit there and suffer. I don't know who Mr. Beast is. Is he the one who started it? 20 million. Some Canadian big shot donated a full million not too long ago. Zero is nothing. 20 million is something. Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't understand why anybody would be negative about it. I mean, planting a bunch of trees can only help us improve the environment, right? There's, is there any negative about it? I mean, maybe there's something. I just don't know what it is. It's not bad. It gets more focused than it deserves. Okay. Interesting. Mr. Beast is one of the biggest YouTubers, and he's the one leading Team Trees. He's always giving away money, and he makes a lot on YouTube. Oh, okay. I see. Oh, I can understand that. It's hard to... Hard to see people being successful and generous when you are feeling the opposite. <laughs> That's... I actually... I I struggle with that myself whenever I see my singer, singer friends, like, posting on YouTube about, Oh, I'm getting to sing with this great gig this day and I'm like oh it's great for you god I hate you you know it's like I wish I was singing for the Chicago Lyric Opera like famous person you happen to be you know okay he didn't hit all of those let's cloak that Okay, could we, could we maybe not have half of our shots dodged, please? Okay. What deserves more? Except cats. <laughs> what deserves more attention than, uh, than a bunch of 20 million trees? Cats. You don't think the movement was started to make a change in that regard? If anything, its sole purpose is to give matter to the topic and it's successful doing exactly that. Give matter to the topic. People like Elon Musk joined in and definitely going somewhere. That was a great double reward. Holy crap. If I get a store right now. Okay. All right. We could turn. This run can turn on big time here. Really soon here. Like, I worry about being able to live and pay rent in $100 here. And that would make such a difference in your life. Yeah. Well, I, you know, the tough thing is. Okay. This is a pretty good deal, actually. And I don't want to fight this guy. It, it is It is hard when you see. I understand that. And it's. It's one of those things that I feel like, as a person, you have to learn to learn to. I don't want to say be less selfish, but not not let the selflessness of other people feel like a personal attack, kind of thing. You know, even if you don't feel like it's a personal attack, it's it's like, you know, it's like seeing somebody give money to somebody homeless. You're like, yeah, oh, I bet that person thinks they're just so great giving them. You know, it's like, eh, they probably genuinely just feel like that person needs help, you know? And so it's, 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 you gotta have to, it's, it's a hard thing, I think, to see generosity and not feel like, well, I could use that help, you know? <laughs> right, I'm just gonna, wow, this only sells for 10? Wow, well, I'm still gonna do it. God, I really want to get this flack online. It takes, what, 75? Yeah. Hey, what's up, Sneaky Legs? How are you doing? That could better be great, but again, I really want to get flack plus Vulcan, because that would be so much better. Wow! Three stores tacked on top of each other. Great. Um, like, uh, maybe 2 billion trees for 20 million. That would be something. <laughs> but 20 million for 20, it's nothing. Well, you want it to be more money for the same amount of trees. No, you want it to be more trees for less, for the same amount of money. I got you, okay. <laughs> I don't know. Tw Two billion's a lot. <laughs> you don't take it personally, it's just hard to keep motivated when life kicks you in the pants every day. Yeah. Well, the other thing that you say there, we Titans, when other people are so fortunate, that's one of the things that is, is tough. Because I, I have, again, I, I fight this too, is I look at people like Donald Trump or other rich people and things. God, they're just so lucky. A lot of people out there, Donald Trump might be actually just lucky that he had a dad who gave him a small loan of a million dollars and then just kept getting richer. It might not be that simple, but... There are people out there who do work like work like crazy and all that stuff. So it's 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 again it's one of those things where it's like you gotta 
Gotta not let other people's good stuff be your bad stuff. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes sense or not. Uh, do I want that deal? Not really. I want more scrap. I want more money. Talking about money. More money, more problems. You get that? I I can't say I know how you feel, but you can't imagine how you feel about it all. Yeah. Okay, let's see here. Uh, we... We're in the solar flare thingy. Like when I drive all past all the nice big mansions on the way to my church job, where all the people who make millions of dollars every year live, I, I sometimes go, do they really deserve this nice big house? What are they doing? You know, deserve this nice big house. It's like, well, probably some of them have worked really hard all their lives to be able to afford that. But some of them probably were born rich and got a job at a oil company and then just have been rich all their lives, you know? So it's like... And in the U.S., that was kind of that whole big, you know, the rich get richer thing. Of course, that's, I think, all over the, the world, so. It's, it's one of those inequalities of the human life that I don't know how to fix it. I don't know if it ever will ever will be fixed. That was worth. One damage for six, uh, six stuff. That was great. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We're just going to vent this room because it's right next to a vent. People who are lucky and people who work hard every day, but being disabled, you have to work hard every day to seem even seem normal. Being disabled in an invisible way makes those around you make make your life an echo chamber of why aren't you good enough? Yikes! Well, it sounds like you need a positive thing in your life. You need to get a positive outlook, uh, out, not outlook, outlet. Get something in your life that's positive so you don't feel down all the time. And I don't know what that would be. But, uh, you know, you don't want to also, and again, this is no personal attack, but you also don't want to feel sorry for yourself all the time either. You know, it's like you got to find positive ways to feel like you're making progress or moving forward in your life kind of thing, which when you're disabled, it's probably twice or more times harder to make that happen, so... Your crew consists of dead people. Am I seeing that right? <laughs> uh, sneaky legs. That's probably because of um, we had an issue with our stream earlier. Earlier, where um, I I didn't stream for the first hour of my stream because I had an issue with OBS and stuff not working. So I had to change a bunch of settings, and one of the settings that ended up getting changed was. Uh, my green screen so it's just it's just the color thing I'm gonna have to fix it eventually probably gonna have a completely different um, stream set up soon nice good dodge uh, let's see okay um, let's see here I guess I'll auto fire this. Why not? All right. Well, I was raging pretty hard, but we do have hacking plus cloaking and a Vulcan. That's pretty insane. So we're actually looking pretty good right now. Cool idea for a mod. What's that? What's a cool idea for a mod? Uh oh, having like undead crew or something. I mean, be very, very, uh, very fitting for Halloween. That's for sure. Uh, no surrender. We want all the things. Give me all the, all the stuff. Fire on here. Okay. Hey, what's up, Chikatsune? How are you doing, my friend? Okay, 22 scrap. Got three jumps. All right, what do we get next? Uh, probably the hacking upgrade, and then we look at third shield. So that is a uh, pretty good offensive and defensive ship, actually. Okay. Well, hope we can cloak and hack our way through this. Only seven drone parts. I need to conserve drone parts more when I can. That's a good dodge. There. We 
can't say anything on the matter because European hours. What? Whoops. I'm auto fired and screwed it up. Crap. I didn't use my cloaking. Now I don't have my cloaking. And now I don't have weapons. God damn it, man. And then that guy just dodges everything. Come on, give me a break game. All right, hack his goddamn weapons. I'm trying to save drone parts. Just going to make me take more damage. useful amount of time here. Okay, we finally got some good dodges. All right, now we should be good. There we go. Double fire new weapons. Right now. Okay. Okay, you go heal. Nice double reward. Okay. All right. All right. I think we might have gotten over the hump here. level two hacking now. Do I do that? I think we do. I'm not doing great on power, but if I get that, that'll help me do things like get the shields down, level three shields down, or keep weapons down longer and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and do it. I love me some free stuff and an exit beacon. Oh god. Abandoned sector, uncharted nebula. Uh, I went to two abandoned in a row earlier. Let's not do abandoned because... Uh, a Lania's bomber or two could wreck this run. I don't feel that confident in our build right now. Okay. Repugnant on the weapons. Crap, by the way, you have really nice weapons, by the way. By, by the way, just in case you didn't notice that about your weapons. Nice. Okay, that's great. Now we just cloak. Will 60% dodge be enough? Probably not. Oh, I should have just done this. But 60% is better than 15%, so let's do it. All right. So three out of five shots hit me. So I had, no, two out of five. So actually, I think that actually was exactly 60% dodge for once. I'm pretty bad at math, but I think that was what we got there. Um, five field corner and scrap now. Okay. Let's see here. Um. How much power do we have? 15, 16. Let's get one power. Man, I missed my pre-igniter from my previous run. So who's going trick-or-treating tonight, huh? Is anybody going trick-or-treating tonight? I don't know. I'm trying to sw switch chat to something a little more positive. <laughs> who's who's going to go trick-or-treating? Rand, we're all adults and we're all angry adults. Shut up. Nobody wants to hear about it. <laughs> but uh, trick-or-treating is fun. I actually should do something fun tonight for Halloween. Who's, who's doing fun stuff tonight? Anybody got like a Halloween party going on or something? You know what I'm doing? I'm gonna get boarded by a bunch of humans. Getting boarded by a bunch of humans is my favorite thing ever. Okay. I like this orange shield. I wish it was a little smaller because it goes off the screen a bit, which is always a little funky with missile dodging. You just had one? You said what? Uh, she had a Halloween party and you're recovering from it? <laughs> yeah, I guess Halloween parties would be something you'd have to recover recovery from. Recover from. She had a party, nice. It's funny, the trick-or-treating thing, we simply don't have in Denmark, but everyone knows what it is. Nice. 
Um, how much are you gonna offer me? Yeah, I'll take that. Well, apparently trick or treating was somebody at my church job last night was like talking about where, like, where Halloween all came from and all this stuff, and it's kind of interesting to hear all the background because it was originally it was a Celtic holiday of some sort that like many of those pagan holidays Christianity adopted and changed but it never changed all the way to a Christian thing and always stayed kind of the spooky remembering the dead kind of thing so it's kind of interesting party party recovery arm <laughs> oh, sounds like a that sounds like an augment I need to find I need to get doors I'm getting boarded like every other jump which is insane there's two guys in there. What is it? Two humans. Okay, that's really good. Apparently the door, uh, the door upgrade is the next upgrade I need to get. Uh, okay, good. They left. Let's actually get you guys to heal real fast. Good dodge, all right. I was not expecting that. There we go, I was gonna say. Surely, surely we can get this burst laser offline before it fires again, surely we can. All right, more and more borders. Um, no, no, that's not a bad deal. But I'd rather kill you and get 28 scrap in the same amount of fuel. When Halloween supposed to be about the dead come to life for an evening? Yeah, it was like a, um, supposed to be this thing where, uh, how did it work exactly? Um, like, it was at the end of the year. It was like their New Year's Eve is when, and when is the date it happened. And it was a thing where they would meet and do a big bonfire and the druids would, like, try to bless the fire to help their loved ones move on to the afterlife. And everybody would take a flame and from the big bonfire that had been blessed. And you take it into your house and you light your own hearth with it. And that's supposed to protect you from any spirits coming into your house or something like that. I don't know. I don't remember all the details. There are a lot of details that he talked about last night. But it was, it was interesting. Right, let's get doors. There's all sorts of different, you know, religious things that have kind of lived on to our modern holidays and stuff. Pagan tradition is based around the veil between this world, veil and the between this world and the next being very thin. Oh, okay. All right, attack this, attack this guy. Um, I have cloak. I'm gonna try to not use hacking. Try to be greedy. Try to greed it. What the hell? How did? 0% dodge, that's how we did it. <laughs> so I dodged zero shots when I didn't have cloaking up. When I had my 60% dodge with cloaking, I dodged I dodged nothing. This game is just stupid today, man. This is just really dumb. I, this is just... I don't understand how I keep getting hit by every single shot every time. And I'm getting zero dodges every time. I, look, he had 100% dodge that volley right there. 100 effing percent dodge of that volley. Unbelievable, man. It's just unbelievable my RNG today. It's insane. Jesus Christ, man. 60% dodge. Couldn't dodge the missile. And the reason I had only 60% dodge and not more was because I dodged none of the shots to let Ion get through to hit my piloting. Just unfreaking believable this this run right now. The veal between both words. Well, you misspelled veil. It's V E I L, not V I E L. That's why I misspelled. Like what? What word are you saying there? <laughs> so, don't blame me for mispronouncing your misspelling, please. Veil is V-E-I-L, not V-I-E-L. But the veal between both worlds, 
Sounds delicious. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if I've ever had veal. Is veal the like baby, the baby deer, or is venison? Venison is deer. Veal is baby cow, right? So veal is the one that there's like bad stuff around because it's a baby cow or something. I have had a Halloween party tradition since moving into this house as we had a crazy party for a complete rede redecoration. It gets bigger every year, but for me, it's more like the living become the dead and the dead coming to life. All right. Uh, that's a decent deal. Look at that. Spooky, scare scary skeletons send shivers down your spine. I, I can't even talk today either. It's a good song. Love that song. All right, I'm gonna try to not use a hacking thing here. If I just cloak the burst laser three, we should be fine, right? Right? We should be fine, hopefully. You know what's effing amazing? Venison. An old lady sells spicy venison sausages at the local farmer's market. It's wonderful, first time you've had it. I had a, uh, I've never had just straight venison, like, like a steak or anything, but I have had I had a teacher in high school who was a hunter, you know, live in Texas, everybody's a hunter. But I had a teacher who hunted deer and he made deer jerky, so I guess that would be venison jerky and he sold it. Sold it to his kids in the class, so I you could buy venison jerky for like a dollar. And that was very good. Welcome to Elmer Fudge Street. That's all, folks. Uh, that would be Porky Pig, I guess, huh? All right, uh, I'm a little low on health. Do I get third shield? Don't really have the power for it, but I feel like that's the next way to go here. All right, all right, what you got? Missile, I got third shield, so of course you're gonna have ion plus a missile. Of course you would. All right, I just, uh, I'm like, screw it. I don't care, I'm just gonna always hack missiles. For as long as possible. Don't even care. Don't even want to mess with missiles anymore. I have that spooky, scary skeleton song stuck in my mind now. <laughs> hey, all right, we got the ion or the uh, missile offline. Beautiful. Uh, probably be good to have shields now. One, two, three. There we go. Oh, here we go. Alright, no more doges for you. This. The missile. Beautiful. Okay. Nice. Good amount of scrap. Alright, let's check what's in the next sector before I spend it on power. If I get back a battery at a store, it would be good. NG Homeworlds, all right. I think this is the first NG sector I've had today. No wonder I've had such a hard time. No freaking free NG sector stuff. Gainage. Gainage, yes. Gainage is a great word. Free stuff gainage. The acquiring of free stuff. Nice. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Um, another free Mantis boarding event. That makes the, what, the second one this run? Yes, please. Get rid of your own cruise oxygen. Love it. Um, I have three shields, so am I safe here? I don't want to do that exactly. Let's go cloak that. Buy ourselves time to deal with these boulders. Reindeer, reindeer meat is delicious. <laughs> uh, you know, I might need to hack the drone control because defense drone. I have both defense drones. It's actually the same. Um, but getting a getting a hacking drone past all of these drones. Uh, let's let's give it a let's give it a little bit. Let's be patient here. Be patient. I might be able to still do this. So we can go for the drone control. See if we can get them online. That would be good. Wow. Well, 
not only do they have all these defense drones, they also have a million percent dodge. How the hell did you get through? No, oh, because I dodged zero. You have a million percent, I have zero percent dodge. Just, just the things. Okay, let's close that. Okay, let's try to get the hacking offline so I can actually get here without... Okay, there we go, nice. Even the shots that I get through are getting freaking dodged. Come on, get him. There we go. Get that shit. How? You were just off. You have like five engines over there repairing in a two person room or some sh Some crap. Yeah, let's, let's lay off the swearing, Rand. You've done enough S and F bombs today. Reindeer meat. Rudolph the red nose. Medium rare steak. Had a very delicious flavor. Uh, that would probably not make some people happy for you to eat Rudolph. All right, um, what do we want to get here? Repair, and that's about all we really need. Hey, did you guys know you could get an anti-bio beam in stores? <laughs> uh, do I want Ion Stunner? Actually, I might want to hold on to that for now. Two power. Um, should I check the store? What if I could get my du double Vulcan in the vault in the uh, pumpkin ship? That would be crazy. Stealth weapons again, though. Okay. Stealth weapons were pretty pretty big last time. Maybe I just get the mind control to deal with all the borders. I am not getting a lot of crew today, so let's just get all the systems. Let's just do that. Stealth weapons kind of a meme. It's great, but definitely not needed. Oh, all right, more free stuff. Thanks, NGs. Love you. Love you, NGs. Uh, that could be a uh, losing crew event, I believe. I think I would need level 2 heal bay for that. Losing crew would be bad. Okay, lots of empty jumps. A few free stuff jumps. We need less empty jumps and more free stuff jumps. Uh, Kill yourselves, please. Of course you're playing a pumpkin. Hi, by the way. What's up, St. Trasa? How are you doing? Of course I am. What else would I be playing on Halloween? Really? <laughs> Of course I am. How are you doing this fine Halloween? Hallow's Eve. Hallow's End. Is Halloween a big thing in the UK? Any UK people here? Y'all y'all like the spooky ha 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 holiday? I feel like that probably is big in the UK like it is in... U.S. Brahm ship. What is a Brahm ship? Ignore it's a tarp. Pumpkin with those rooms like that remind me of a cat with melon helmet. Yeah, I, I was thinking. I said that earlier. With the rooms like this, looks like um, a zombie from Minecraft with a, a helmet on it or something. I considered myself pretty darn good at this game until I saw your videos on YouTube. <laughs> we suck, as sisters. Ow! Free. Five hole damage, game. I'm sure you're very good at the game, Ms. Misaka. I play too much of this game. I have thousands of hours, so blame it on my stream actually having people watch me play it. Not me actually being insanely good or anything. <laughs> uh, it's not as much as the US. Buffer, get a few trick-or-treaters. Oh, okay. Not as much as the US, but you do get a few trick-or-treaters, okay. NG crew, okay, so that's the NG quest. It's pretty big, or was for you growing up. Well, I mean, it's kind of the same here. It's it's more of a kid's holiday. I mean, what holidays aren't kids' holidays? Christmas is presents for kids, mostly. Halloween is for kids to go around getting free candy. Um, 
Thanksgiving, I guess, is more of a family holiday, but and New Year's, I guess, is uh, the adults get drunk holiday. <laughs> so maybe there are some that aren't uh, kid holidays, but... I didn't even fire that time. Nice. I feel like most holidays are... Well, most of the, like, gift-giving holidays or whatever are kid-themed. Oh, man. Uh, he's gonna... If he ion intrudes... How much ion damage does that do? I actually don't know. But we need him to not take out my weapons. Oh crap. God damn it, man. Actually, I wonder if this guy stays in here if that'll give us keep us having any power on the weapons. It's a hundred percent. So it does. No, it's just enough it's three. God damn it. He's running away and I intruder right next to my weapons room. Thanks, game. Hate you. Really hate you, game. Really hate you. And he's gonna go back and forth between my weapons and that, isn't he? Please kill him before he gets in the thing. I'll poke at it. Maybe there's a small chance we get him before he leaves. I think there's. I think it's like a five percent chance we actually stop him before gets out. Are you effing kidding me, game? Two times he gets on here and two times in the same goddamn room. Only way I do it is if I can take out his piling right now. Okay, we got it. All right, we have a chance. I also now need to take this out. Is there any way I can stop this guy from getting through here quicker? If I go into the doors, slow him down. God damn it, man. This is, this is bullshit. This has been my RNG this entire run. The only way he stops me from killing him, I an intruder into my weapons. And he did it fucking twice. He did it fucking twice, man. That is insane. That is insane that he did it twice. This is such bullshit, man. I, oh, this game is so frustrating. This game is so frustrating when shit like this happens over and over and over and fucking over again, man. Life bars are black. No, it's just a color issue. It's a color issue. Okay, well, he's leaving. Fuck this game, man. This shit happens over and over. I've had so many fights where... Again, it's just the worst shit that can happen. And it's the only way that stops me from having success. And that's what happens, man. God damn it, man. Uh, we also have a few remnants of old holidays, religious holidays here. For example, we celebrate some saint from ancient times by lighting a massive bonfire. Oh, okay, nice. This pumpkin come with a Vulcan? No, I got one for free. It came with a uh, firebomb, a basic laser, and a... Crystal, uh, the big, the rarest weapon in the game, the Crystal Burst Mark Three or Two or whatever it is. F you, F me, F me, F you. <laughs> uh, yeah, the the life bars are green because my stream, I'm streaming differently. I'm not using my streaming laptop today. I had to quickly change all of my settings and swap to a different computer to even stream today because OBS and Elgato finally got into such a heated argument that they couldn't resolve their differences. 
So, Flash Gordon theme. Rand, he's the savior of the universe. <laughs> What's up, Dark Dragon? Uh, savior of the universe. The uh, I don't know about savior. More of like the salty yeller at the universe. That's that's more of what I am. The salter yeller at the universe. -er. Oh, he died as he walked through that room. Sucks to be you. Get vented, humans. Get vented. The ship gives me an idea for a custom ship. A spiral layout that can only be vented from one end. <laughs> there should be a ship called the Ventilator. That's just... It's... All the rooms are a vent. All the world is a stage. And all the humans are just... Players meant to be vented. The ventilator. Maybe not every room has a vent, but like a very strategically placed vent, a venting system. Salt cellar of the universe. There you go. So always remember, we're here supporting you, even though we're buried by the gigatons of salt you throw. Yes, <laughs> you probably are. Sorry about that. Let me guess, you have boarding? Ah, thank God, he doesn't have boarding. Or free boarders. This run, I think I've been boarded by... Multiple mantids for free, multiple times. I've had guys run away from me multiple times because I couldn't... Because of stupid stuff, I think. Maybe that was only once, I can't remember. A lot of crap this run, though. A lot of crap. A lot of bull crapple. Bull snizzle crapple. Actually, I want to have my dodge up for missiles. Alright, so now I have a choice. Do I dodge the big missile or do I dodge the little missile? Um I can't dodge both, so I guess we just dodge we dodge we wait for the big one. Because we're not at 100% dodge, so we will never dodge. Yeah. Okay, we actually might get a double missile dodge here. God damn it, man. Seriously? This one, right as it crosses the threshold, that's when this one fires, so I can't get a, I can't get a double dodge. And of course we don't dodge the other one. Oh my god, game. So much shit today. Well, so much shit this run, really. It's been this run where all the bad RNG's been happening. I mean, this guy's dodging over half the shots. I kind of need crew right now. Do I take a human? Thank you for the follow. Uh, salt, 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 34. <laughs> what the follow? Thanks for that follow, salt, salt, salt. Welcome to the randoms. I have a feeling you've been here before. I have a feeling you live here. <laughs> salt, salt, salt. I like how your name's Salt, Salt, Salt 34. Uh, the Taurus, but every wall has an airlock. Oh, like the Angie ship? Yeah, the donut. The donut with all all the walls have a bunch of doors. Missile hits, tis bust a scratch? No. One tiny missile hits for one damage, and I yell like my entire face got blown off. That's, that's how I, that's my reaction. One missile runs over. Run is over. Okay. Let's get a power. Alright, this is NG Quest. Okay. Was it the other NG Quest guy that got out, actually? That would mean we're kind of screwed here. He's running. How do I stop him? Do I do this? Do I pack his shields? I think that's what I do. He doesn't have boarding. Go ahead and cloak this, and not the big laser. And we're gonna do this. Uh, nothing's hitting his shield, so I need to hit his shields. Okay. Do you see why I'm so salty? That was four misses that just came up. Did anybody else see that? Four misses. 
I shot four shots and got four misses or something. I don't know. And I can't, I, I can't dodge a missile. I have 0% dodge. Hey, what do you know? Guess what? Didn't dodge a missile, then uh, bomb into my weapons because I couldn't dodge it because I had no more dodges. So, you know, F me. <laughs> I fucking hate this game. I fucking hate it. A bomb into my weapons, into a missile, into my weapons. What the actual fuck, game? Literally every shot into my weapons. So I can't... I can't stop this NG quest from getting away. Literally the only thing that stops me from doing this NG quest both times was them only hitting my weapons. Or ion intruding into my weapons. Or effing me in my A. This is so stupid, man. <laughs> Why is my RNG so fucking bad? Why? What have I done to deserve this? Do I curse out this game too much? It's probably that. You still want to see the ship with an MC and multiple TPs that are in isolated rooms? This room could each be ventable and your ship would start with a repair burst so you could repair the TVs without going there. Could be like an aquarium ship. <laughs> okay. So we can abduct people and watch them suffocate. Sounds cool. Both both of those uh, NG quest missions right there, uh, NG quests, I they got away just because F me, bad RNG. They literally only hit my weapons and my like piloting. So couldn't dodge. Because fuck you, that's why I said FTL. Yeah, yeah that's right. Oh, goddamn this game. Seriously. Lovely ship. Lovely ship. FTL, you can go F yourself. Seriously. I, can't, I cannot believe the RNG. Oh, guess what? Another Iron Intruder drone with a guy running away. I mean, what do I even do? What do I do when they have shit? Insane amounts of defense. And they're running. Like, every goddamn ship is doing this. It's making me so goddamn salty. And I can't even, I can't even do my thing right here. Okay, at least he's not in my weapons, you piece of crap. All right, let's, how about, how about not a triple dodge on my flak this time? Maybe, how about that? There, that pulled his pilot, good. He's already charging again. Because he's got a repair drone. Why wouldn't he have a repair drone with a defense drone and an ion intruder drone? So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. That is seven drone power, by the way. That is fucking seven drone power this guy has. Somebody tell if my math's wrong, but I'm pretty sure ion intruder is three power. Repair drone's one. Defense drone mark. Uh, two is three drone power. That's a seven drone power uh, drone drone system right there. I need a holy hand grenade. Need slug to throw such grenade. <laughs> slug to throw holy hand grenade, huh? All right. In my humble opinion, FTL viewers need to migrate to Cosmeteer. Their combat gameplay is relatively similar, and you don't have to deal with RNG. I played Cosmeteer, and from what I remember, it doesn't have nearly the replayability of FTL. But it's been a while. A number of people have said that to me. You need to play uh, Cosmeteer, man. And I think I have played it. I just can't remember the gameplay. I need my drone parts. Von Roland, thank you for the single bit. <laughs> Appreciate that. All right, so I'm basically out of drone parts. Automated reloader would be, oh, that would be amazing. I want to get that online though. 
Okay, double automated reloader. Um, we need drone parts too. I don't know if I ever get this ion spinner. You know what? I wonder if the ion spinner will be better than flak until I get the other weapon power. Another stealth weapons available there. That's why you stopped playing FTL. RNG just got too bad for you. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's four shields, Zoltan shield, and a missile. Um, is Ion Stunner better than Flag? Let's get two shields. I think it is. Uh -huh. Two more bets. Thanks, Von Roll. Appreciate it. Roguelikes aren't for everyone. Yeah. I like FTL, even though I rage. I mean, 94% dodge, and I still didn't dodge a missile. I don't know why why I would rage so hard at that. But uh, the game is great. The game is great. The RNG is bullshit. I mean, 94% <laughs> uh, dodge, and he hits me with his fucking missile. My god. Just unbelievable. Ninety-four fucking percent dodge. Find no reason to do that. He's a stunner. I don't think I would cat watch Cosmeteer. You just want to watch something I know. I mean, heck, you're sitting here playing RuneScape right now. <laughs> nice. Double fire in the weapons. Do you still get a freaking missile off? You do. Poking it. Hey, what do you know? 94 actually worked for once. You don't know why I'd rage at 99% missile hitting me. Yeah, I don't know why. 99%. Normal that something would hit you when you have a 99% chance to not be hit by that something, right? If you like it, then you better put some bits in it. If Too much. Like it, then okay, you weren't really doing one bit at a time. <laughs> Too much effort. Here, have 100. All right, thank you for the bits, fun rolling. Yes. Thanks. I would much rather have a dollar than a hundred pennies, so I appreciate that. Thanks for stopping, stop throwing your pennies at me. So the Ion Stunner would be 90 scrap to get online. All right, I do need power, so let's get the power and then hope we can get the Ion Stunner, because that would be a really good weapon system to complete our build. That RNG people would figure out the optimal strategy you played every time, then get bored and move on to the game. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, there's a reason I keep playing this, even though the RNG is frustrating as hell. It's because it means the run really is random and different every time. Okay, can I, can I dodge? There we go. Alright. Come on, getting our training maxed out here. Okay. I, I really am I'm dodging nothing, man. I mean, he does have a lot of lasers, but come on, game. If I knew how to get bits, I would probably do a thing where I give 10 bits every en enemy missile weapon you encounter. Okay. Um, no, I don't want a human. It's gotten so bad, only way for me to play is to get set up to involve emitting RNG entirely. I don't know how you get a setup that emits RNG. I mean, hacking is probably the best way because you can make it so we can't randomly dodge your shots, but again, then you just get the optimal strategy, which the optimal strategy, it really is getting hacking and cloaking every time. But it's random if you find those, so. Max piloting for 25, I mean, it's a deal, but I don't, I don't want to do that. Do I dive for a store at 75 scrap? If I would wanted to sell something, I would, but I don't. Beam teleporter hacking. Uh, I got you. Okay, so doing the teleporting thing. Well, that's still random, because, I mean, you could run into guys that just... All the events that kill your crew. Okay. Hacking and a lot... These... These ships I'm fighting are just insane, man. What are you hacking? If you hack my weapons, I'm hacking. You hacked my hacking. 
hack my hacking so when I try to hack your hacking, I can't hack your hacking. It's a fun game. Um, let's go be in sensor so I can use my mind control here. Okay, good dodge, good dodge. So as soon as Vulcan gets spun up, we will mind control this pilot. Four shield, Zoltan. Shield thing. There we go. Alright, we killed the, the Zoltan shield thing. Beautiful. Nice. Uh oh, somebody got wrecked by Rambot Plus. Rambot Plus! Darn you! Life form scanner in sector eight. Okay, great. Hey, what do you know? All the repair I was going for got knocked out second jump. Cool. Cool, all right. Let's go ahead and do this. All right, so this is a seven power weapon system. It's pretty OP setup. Let's hope we can get some defense to go along with it. Pumpkin scanner. <laughs> What's inside that pumpkin? Huh? I don't know. There's only one way we can find out. To the pumpkin scanner. <laughs> to the pumpkin scanner. Life form scanner to replace the slug. Truly a worthy trade. Truly. We're gonna hack your uh, hack your piling once. So our Vulcan gets one up. Oh, great. Okay. Forgot that Twitch thinks anything with a dot in it is a link. Well, if there's a dot and then a space and then a letter right after it, yes. Well, it's it's not Twitch. It's it's Randbot. It's my robot that thinks that. It's anything where it's a letter. Oh crap! Halberd beam's gonna go off, isn't it? Oh god! Get the halberd beam offline now. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Okay. All right. He was a terrible shot. He only did two damage. Okay. But yes, my Rambot Plus thinks that anything with something dot something. If there's no space, it thinks it's a blink and times you out. Sorry about that, Samsara. It's not you, it's me. It's not me, it's Rambot. Okay. Do, do. Alright, we got at least we got this repair. Okay, that's good. Do, 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 do. Okay, wow, this this guy actually had a really rough route himself. He actually got wrecked by the route more than I did for once. Okay, so I need power. I want max hacking. Backup battery to that. Yeah, I guess so. Let me just try to get a little more power for the end here. You and your missiles. Hack your missiles. We're gonna auto fire everything at your missiles. I hope with max level hacking and cloaking, we never take a missile shot. We might take health damage though, which would suck. Actually, we might not ever. Cloaking and hacking, we might never get to fire his health, which would be great. There we go. Look at that. Nice. Beautiful. All right. We have a really good build for killing crew, too, on the boss. Just firing everything at, everything at the shields. Well, I don't get any more scrap, so, except from the boss. That's great. All right, so uh, I get power and a value point. So probably we want cloak and value point. That gives us my control online. Okay. I have kind of the bare minimum of what I want for defense, but my offense is strong enough that we should be fine. Wow. That was, that was a snap, crackle, pop. Okay. 
Alrighty, boss. Bring it on. Don't hack my weapons, or I'm leaving. Oh, that's a beautiful hack. It's a beautiful thing. Alright, so I'm gonna wait to mind control until... Um... Until his second cloak, after his second cloak happens, and our Vulcan is spun up. Those are the two things I'm looking at. Or I can mind control the pilot, so he can't repair that. That actually could be pretty good, but it's a little early for that. That's right, here we go, boss fight time. Let's actually go ahead and start this early. This should still be lasting as the Vulcan is spun up. Okay, we don't have cloaking here, don't hit my weapons. Nice, that was a good double dodge. Oh, that's a fire though. I cannot. I cannot lose my cloaking here. My control. Good, got it. Nice. All right, that's some good crew kills. Take out the missile. My backup battery go down. Must have been. Some weapon got through. Okay, there we go. Woo! Ho, ho, ho! That was a good bunch of crew kills there. That was a good phase one. Took two damage and killed, like, I don't know, three, four, five crew, something like that. Really, really good. If you can stun them in the, uh... If you can stun your enemies in the shield room while it's hacked, and just keep firing at it, you can get a lot of crew kills. That's my favorite strat for when I don't have like boarding or something, is just focus on the shield room and take them out. All right, very nice. 26 scrap, I could get um, sensors. Or do I save up? For, I probably save up for mind control value one for the final phase. So next we gotta deal with the boarding drone. So let's do this, we're gonna use you to fight him, probably, depending on where he goes. If he goes in, like, sensors, I'll just allow him to stay in there, I think. Strafed him with the Vulcan. That's right. Get strafed, bro. Back up battery, I would like to use, so let's go do this. Actually, I'll send you after the first missile shot. That's what I'll do. How come he only has three shields? I already hit the shields once? That's weird. Oh, because the ion hit him. Yeah. So we can't cloak this. Okay, that's not too bad. Now we send you here and you here. It's a good vent right there for us. This, this. I just don't die, sir. Okay. Close now. So stop firing. Nope. Get this. Holy crap, how did that last long enough for you to actually do damage there? Holy crap, and how come I can not dodge a single shot? What the hell, game? I don't have cloaking for this, so this is gonna hurt. Yeah, no more goddamn missiles for you. Let's use your own control. Jesus Christ. That was a shitty step, uh, phase two right there. We didn't take that much damage, but that was some pretty bad RNG. I don't know how. It must have just been really unlucky timing with when we came out of Cloak and all of his combat drones firing at the same time or some stupid BS RNG like had this entire run has had. Yeah, that was really close to getting out of hand. Really, really close there. Really close to losing two crew and really close to taking a lot more damage. K 
Okay, all right. Uh, so we want mind control value point for the final phase. And that's all we can get, okay. Uh, there, okay. All right, so we follow, counter the mining, the mind control. If we if the boarding gets overwhelming, we run away. Shouldn't shouldn't be too bad though. <laughs> you love to do the FTL command. And the FTL command is just for that card in Slay the Spire. That's a game I need to play more of. I need to play Slay the Spire. Y'all, you my friends, let me know when the new Slay the Spire character is done. Or really close to being done. I wanna I'd like to play some more Slay the Spire at some point. Okay, let's do that. All right, we have this. Right, we should be good here. Nice, didn't hit my weapons. All right. All right, missiles. How many? How much power do you have in your missiles? Jesus. Bam, GG Cookie Time. We got there, my friends. We did it. Through this hell of a run, through hell and high water, we killed the boss. Through ridiculously bad RNG with this really fun, crazy jack-o'-lantern ship. And the history books will tell of... Crap, chat always moves right at the end there. Okay, let me see here. Uh... Uh... And the history books will tell that the evil rebellion was crushed by the terror of the evil pumpkin ship. <laughs> Faster than spite, that's right. Ran next year, you should paint your head as a pumpkin and be pumpkin head stream. <laughs> okay. Uh, doesn't Rand have a list of ships he wants to play somewhere? I have a list of viewer created ships. Yes, Vex told you. You wouldn't mind some Slay the Spire? I want to play it once. Um, there's new content. Because I played it a ton. A while ago. But once there's a new character out and I can do new stuff with it, that's when I'm going to play it. Easier than Kessel one, that's right. We don't have any cookies, so it's the GG Cinnamon Bun time. Nice. <laughs> there should be 500 points for you eating a cookie. Like on an extension? Okay. Let's check our score. Wow. Yeah. I thought that felt pretty low. 44.67. So many ships got away. So much crap we missed out on because of stupid crap like not being able to do the NG quest. Where's the list? Um, type exclamation point. Ship list? I'm not sure. Uh, let me give you the link. There it is. So if you go to the sheet three, you will see a list of these ships I have done. And a uh, list of the ships I have played. I am actually updating that right now because Jack O' Lantern is done. Uh, oops, I forgot to put. Yeah, done. Well, some of these guys I forgot to put done that I've actually finished them. Done. Done. All right. So we started late, but we are going to do one more, uh, one more ship today. I think I'm going to do. Um, DJ Total Blazing's Kappa. I have a bunch of good ships to play. I'm kind of getting the ones that have been sent recently because they all sound interesting. So, really quick, I'm set. Sure, she's restroom. Thank y'all so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the FTL. Sorry for the salt on that run. I don't know. When I have technical difficulties on my stream, I like pen. The rage is pent up inside, and then it releases when FTL kicks my ass. So, really quickly, I'm gonna use restroom. We come back. We'll do one more ship probably. And thank you all for hanging out. Uh, do about a minute and a half worth of ads as I use uh, the restroom, and I'll come back and do one more ship. Thanks for hanging out. Y'all rock. See you in a bit, my friends. <laughs>